Mori Tiu's Grey Parrot. Mascarene Grey Parakeet Stellar Sea Cow Carpathian Wise End Pile Builder Megapod Blue Buck Tahiti Rail King Island Emu Great Auk North Island Snipe Broad Faced Potoroo New Zealand Quail Falkland Islands Wolf Quagga Labrador Duck Eastern Hare Wallaby Sea Mink White Winged Sandpiper Short-tailed hopping mouse Tahitian sandpiper
Honshu Wolf. Passenger Pigeon. Thylacine. Australian pig footed bandicoot. Kupri. Mexican grizzly bear. Bali tiger. Barbary lion. Caspian tiger. Javan tiger. Golden toad. Left you and a moth. Zanzibar leopard. Pyrene and Ibex Baiji Dolphin Eastern Cougar Western Black Rhinoceros Pinta Island Tortoise Japanese River Otter Formos and Clouded Leopard Number 10. 
Snow Leopard These rare, beautiful grey leopards live in the mountains of Central Asia. They are insulated by thick hair and their wide, fur-covered feet act as natural snowshoes. Snow Leopards have powerful legs and are tremendous leapers, able to jump as far as 50 feet or 15 meters. They use their long tails for balance and as blankets to cover sensitive body parts against a severe mountain chill. While these amazing creatures have adapted to survive in the harshest of conditions, there is one threat they cannot avoid – humans. Snow leopards are often killed by local farms because they prey on livestock such as sheep, goats, horses and yak calves. This has led to the population to decline to between 4,000 and 6,500, which continues to decline. Number 9. Vaquita a name many have never even heard of, Vaquita are the world's rarest marine mammal and are currently on the edge of extinction. This little porpoise wasn't discovered until 1958 and yet today we are on the brink of losing them forever. Vaquita have large dark rings around their eyes and dark patches on their lips that form a thin line from the mouth to the pectoral fins. They are most often found close to the shore in the gulf's shallow waters, though they can quickly swim away if a boat approaches. It is estimated that the Vaquita could be extinct by 2018 if the accidental killings of these animals continue. Nearly one in every five become entangled and drown in gillnets intended for other marine species, leaving today's entire population of the species to be under 100. Number 8. Asian Elephant Asian elephants are the continent's largest terrestrial mammals. They can reach 6.4 meters in length and 3 meters in the shoulders and weigh as much as 5 tons. They are smaller than African elephants and have proportionally smaller ears, which they keep in constant motion in order to cool themselves. They also have a single finger on the upper lip of their trunks as opposed to African elephants which have a second one on the lower lip. Their skin ranges from dark grey to brown with patches of pink on the forehead, the ears, the base of the trunk and the chest. A significant number of male Asian elephants are tuskless. The percentage of males with ivory varies from just 5% in Sri Lanka to around 90% in southern India, possibly reflecting the intensity of past ivory hunting. Number 7. Javan Rhinoceros The Javan Rhinoceros is the most threatened of the five rhino species with only 57 remaining individuals surviving in Ujung Kulon National Park in Java, Indonesia. Vietnam's last Javan Rhino was poached in 2010. The Javan Rhino is a dusky grey colour and has a single horn of up to 10 inches. Their skin has a number of loose folds giving the appearance of armour plating. This species is very similar in appearance to the closely related Greater One Rhinoceros but has a much smaller head and less apparent skin folds. The population in Ujung Kulon National Park represents the only hope for the survival of a species that is on the brink of extinction. Until the late 19th century and early 20th century, Javan rhinos existed from northeast India and the Sudabans throughout mainland Southeast Asia and on the island of Sumatra. If we lose the population in Java, the entire species will disappear. Number 6. Tiger Tigers are the largest of all the Asian big cats and typically stalk their prey and hunt alone. Being so large, they also have to eat a lot. A single tiger can consume over 40 kilos of meat at one time. The Siberian tigers are the largest subspecies where males can weigh over 300 kilos. Tigers have been known to reach the age of 26 years in the wild, though this is much less likely to be the case now. Tigers have lost 93% of their historical range. Their habitat has been destroyed, degraded and fragmented by human activities. Clearing forests for agricultural uses and timber as well as the building of road networks pose serious threats to the tiger's habitat. As forests shrink away beyond the point of existence, the tigers are forced to hunt domestic livestock, leading them into conflict with human communities and often ending in the death of tigers. Number 5. Polar Bear Polar bears are the largest species of bear on the planet and spend most of their lives on the sea ice of the Arctic Ocean. For this reason, they are actually classified as marine mammals. They have a thick layer of body fat and a water repellent coat that insulates them from the cold air and water. 
Considered talented swimmers, they can sustain a pace of 6 miles per hour by paddling with their front paws and holding their hind legs flat like a rudder. Because of an ongoing and potential loss of their sea ice habitat resulting from climate change, polar bears were listed as a threatened species in the US under the Endangered Species Act in May 2008. Number 4. Soola Another creature you've probably not heard of. And that's because it was only recently discovered. The Zoola was discovered in May 1992 during a joint survey carried out by the Ministry of Forestry of Vietnam and WWF in North Central Vietnam. The find proved to be the first large mammal new to science in more than 50 years and one of the most spectacular zoological discoveries of the 20th century. Although the remaining number of these creatures are not known, they are on the critically endangered list due to the Soola's natural habitat being rapidly destroyed to make way for agriculture, plantations and infrastructure. Number 3. Mountain Gorilla Much like their name would suggest, mountain gorillas reside in forests high in the mountains, at elevations of 8,000 to 13,000 feet. Because of this, they have thicker fur and more if compared to great apes. The fur allows them to survive in a habitat where temperatures can often drop below freezing. However, since humans have moved more and more into the gorilla's territory, the gorillas have been pushed farther and farther up into the mountains for longer periods, forcing them to survive through sometimes deadly conditions. Because of this, in 1989, the population of the mountain gorilla decreased to an all-time low of just 620, though by now it has increased slightly back up to 880. There is still much to be done though, and many threats remain for these animals, including disease from human contact, charcoal from harvesting, and accidental poaching by being caught and harmed by snares set for other animals. Number 2. Hawksbill Turtle Hawksbills are named for their narrow, pointed beak. They also have a distinctive pattern of overlapping scales on their shells that form a serrated look on the edges. These coloured and patterned shells make them highly valuable and commonly sold as tortoise shell in markets. Hawksbills are found mainly throughout the world's tropical oceans, predominantly in coral reefs. They feed mainly on sponges by using their narrow, pointed beaks to extract them from crevices on the reef but also eat sea anemones and jellyfish. Due to the accidental capture on fishing hooks and gillnets, as well as illegal wildlife trade selling hawksbill shells, these turtles are now listed as critically endangered and could face extinction if this continued. Number 1. Giant Panda Giant pandas are peaceful animals with a very distinctive black and white coat and are adored by the world and considered a national treasure in China. They are the rarest member of the bear family and live mostly in bamboo forests high in the mountains of western China where they live almost entirely on bamboo. They need to eat from 26 to 84 pounds of it every day to keep their body weight. A newborn panda is about the size of a stick of butter, about 1 to 9 hundredth of the size of its mother, but can grow up to 330 pounds as an adult. There are currently between 1,800 and 1,900 left in the wild, a number that will hopefully continue to increase with the panda's protected status. Forest destruction reduces pandas' access to the bamboo they need to survive, and hunting remains a threat.